Luigi OP. The chat is blocking out the Luigi's tag. I've met him before too. I just cannot for the life of me remember his tag. Uh, JBW2 is pretty solid as well. I played both of these guys at one point or another. Imagine this is gay wood. I like, can't find the mousey, and chat is blocking out the Luigi player's tag and score. But I really can't. Nate, could you block out? Could you move the chat? I don't remember his tag. I'm waiting for Zonak to move the chat. There we go, Royal James. All right, okay. I don't remember that being his tag, but I do remember his name being James. Shoutouts to Zonak for having the chat there. Royal James is pretty solid. I remember he was at Flex's crib a few years ago. I would imagine playing him. Like, he used to play Flex a bunch. Well, I haven't been to Flex's in about probably like two or three times, but that was like a long time ago. Definitely a solid Luigi player. I'm not yawning because Peach Luigi, I'm yawning because... Long day, I guess. It's been a nice, really nice day. What good weather during the day. It was really even. I'm not sure if that's what I expected from Luigi Peach on FD. I don't know enough about Luigi. You know, a uh, decent amount because of Pope Ward. We've discussed some things before. played him a bunch. But besides Luigi Samus, I really, my knowledge kind of just fades away. I hear Luigi players, well, Hoborg really likes this matchup. Turnips. Okay, I, that was weird. Stealing center stage with Don B is weird. More turn up, grab another turn up. See, that's where I think he's fucked up. You should grab another one. Like, when you have a chance to pull, you should just always pull. Because you can aerial and still hold on to it. Like, right now, he could just have a turn up in his hand. He just doesn't have it. He didn't pull it. And the chance will come later, but I just think you should just always have it. That's just like how I would play Peach, though. And I see a lot of the top features always pull turn up when like someone's back in the corner. Like, you always take the opportunity to when it's just like there. Yep. Like instead of dash dancing around, use that opportunity to grab an item. Because Peach at the end of the day has an item. And Link. And the Links, they have items. They're breaking the game. What the fuck? Oh, wow. That was unlucky. Unlucky for the Peach. Lucky for Royal James. And it was a very good sequence to do it. Honestly, it was pretty optimal because, like, you're bound to get a misfire eventually. Like, if you're doing, like, at least... I think it's one in seven. I don't remember the number. So if you hit your text and then side B, like, four times in a row, it's not... The odds are in your favor. They start to become... Pressure, the pressure. I, ooh, how's JG, JBW gonna respond to this pressure? Oh wow, that was. Could have killed him with that. That much charge? Could have killed him, bro. You'd have been dead. Grab? No. Okay, now uh, he's doing that a little too, too much. He's struggling to finish here. I think he should, yes, that's exactly what I was gonna say. He should go for a grab. Yeah, he should be dead. Okay, so game one goes to Royal James. Nice. Let's see where JBW takes him.
All right, so JBW opts for Fountain Dreams. That is, this is a stage that I like a lot. I like it, but I don't think I love it. Like, this is usually the first place that's banned whenever I play people. But sometimes I don't actually really like to go OG that bad at all. Sometimes I don't even want to go like, like Dream Left that much at all. Like, sometimes I just like Battle for the Yoshi. It really depends on my mood. And he looks like he just shouldn't be making it back. Grab the edge? Question mark? I guess he's just dead. Not sure why I keep yawning. Maybe it is a matchup. It's just naturally making my body yawn. I mean, these guys are good players, so it's not like boring by any means, but it's definitely a long, long matchup. An interesting one at that too, because Mario, Dr. Mario definitely can beat Peach, but Mario has no chance, not nearly as good of a chance. So unless he's a doctor, Mario can't win, and Luigi, the brother, is saying, okay, looks like it's up to me. He definitely has a way better matchup in my opinion than Mario, obviously. These are good techs. Okay. I okay, word, word. <laughs> that was actually like really silly. Luigi does a like, dirty backflip when he does really jump backwards. Fireball does nothing with that fireball. Maybe he was trying to trick him, I don't know, but right now he's down. Yes. We have to play? Well, that's kind of dumb. I drove with Shiro, but all right. I guess I'll go play my match.
What's up, stream? I sat down at an unfortunate time. Because this looks like it's going to be a long matchup. Both. Oh, okay, that was a pretty cool um, cyclone. He intentionally drifted to hit the peach, allowing to live a little, live a little bit and really milk out this stock. This Luigi is also definitely bringing up the lifespan average of all Luigi citizens, and then uh, RNG is gonna end that. All right, that down smash is probably to call out any like rising aerials through platforms, but um, JBW2 does not bite. Very patient player. Even when he has his opponent in a disadvantaged position, he will run into the corners. I don't know how Royal James play, but he is a king, maybe a prince. And they're both just kind of arrowing around each other. Not really, because like no one wants to be the first to really make the move. And even with Luigi's poor aerial drift, he's able to catch JB kind of floating in the no-fly zone. And James says, that does not fly. Oh, coming in with a wave dash up smash, invincible head. I like the idea, but um, not safe on shield. Oh, that was a bull down air, down air. I would have liked if it hit. Oh, wing condition, and he throws it away. He gets the tech, misfire into the sweet embrace of death. That was an exciting five seconds just to end in a death. All right, so I'm JBW2. Mr. J is bringing it back slowly but surely in a very epic fashion. Ooh, dare through the platforms. Little crown was poking out. Falling down with a Nair. Luigi's Nair sends him straight up. Perfect for comboing. I just watched a Plup's new YouTube video where he just played Luigi and did some of the craziest Luigi combos I have ever seen in my life. And unfortunately, none of them can be done on Peach. I'm trying my best to keep my opinions about this Sheik to myself, and I will continue to do so. Just know that I have opinions. All right, that fair is gonna do it. The karate chop right to the cranium. Tied game, both of them are known for living longer than most, but Peach has a real recovery, while Luigi just pretends he has a recovery. Unless he's the hand of horrible, hands of a ho ho board, then it, it becomes the best in the world. Oh, runs into the down smash. That's always unfortunate to see. Oh, spot dodges the jab grab. Can James get something going, because like right now, it's just little small neutral wins by JB. Oh, misses the turnaround grab. And Luigi lives forever, man. Oh, calculated fireball air. You hate to see it. You hate to see it. Miss ledge dash. Well, you know, 